Well, ladies and gentlemen, we gotta talk about this one immediately, okay? Because the entire community is put upside down. We had the Dr. Disrespect situation. We made a video on it, right? We got the Mr. Raffle Waffles. We got the homie Face Jeff. Couldn't believe it, okay? Could not believe it. You have the you have the homie Noah J456, Mr. T likes to fight situation. Man, like what is going on right now? Everybody's dropping like DDTs left and right. Sick is looking like this right now. And the funniest thing here is that while this man is gone, it looks like that the spirit of Bobby Kotick still lives on, man. Oh, shit. Yay! The homie Blaine Truth. It looks like that he got caught with dementia. I guess this is what happens when you constantly wear the helmet, Bruh. man. Like you gotta stop wearing the helmet, but love the homie okay we're gonna get into this video like the video if you do not wear the helmet dislike the video if you wear the helmet though i want to know where you guys at but roll it in may of 2023 i covered activision shutting down sm2 i yeah. asked everyone if they could to like the video comment this is bigger than just the mod shutting down this is bigger than my channel i'm, I'm asking that again i'm asking that again but the difference between a, a year and a half ago roughly and now is that then i was pretty depressed i was pretty depressed that a project i was looking forward to got cease and desisted okay. now I'm not depressed anymore. I'm oh, fucking wow. angry. <laughs> Fuck you. Okay? Just let me get that out. Let me Yo, damn, man. Yeah, I get it. A lot of people are pissed off right now. I get it though. But it's something that happened a year and a half ago. I, I would think that you would assume that it would happen. I mean, yes, uh, a lot of people did see this coming. Like the video if you did see this coming. Dislike if you did not. Context, apparently a year and a half ago, they struck down a mod. Was pretty shitty for Activision to do. Absolutely, I have to agree, right? And a couple of days ago, we heard that we're gonna be getting like Modern Warfare 2 Remaster mod, right? Therefore, a lot of people were like, oh my god, oh my god, I'm shaking. You, you know, a lot of people were shaking, understandably, man, because this community never get any happiness. I get it, guys, I get it. The only thing that we get, and this is uh, how my dogs be looking like right now, the only happiness that we get is the friendly <laughs> It looks like that that's the only type of happiness we get and we don't want that kind of happiness We just want good content, man. We just want good games So somebody goes uh, ahead and makes a Modern Warfare 2 remaster multiplayer mod They make a video on it gameplay busting graphics lit gameplay amazing suckers shaking everybody everybody's like okay you know what it looks like that this is gonna be the year this is gonna be year fast forward like what two three days activision pow son like they strike down the mod and now here we are and like the, the homie right now is looking like this man it looks like that the homie had dementia let me situation. get that out fuck activision yeah they I can agree. eat my entire asshole <laughs> okay no, no other content creator on here. They have their stupid fucking codes and their invites to COD Next and whatnot. No other creator on here will say it like I'm gonna say it. Anyway, they have done it again, and there's no reason for this. In fact, it's worse than last year! And anyone! It it, it, it's the same thing, bro. Like, last year they struck it down, this year they struck it down. I said it last year, something along the lines of, if you're a mod maker, uh, if you're a dev, yeah, you're passionate about it. I love that, I respect that, but guys, like, make your own project instead of working for these companies because these companies don't care bro even if you make a good ass mod you're gonna get cease and desist don't do it man don't do it you're gonna waste your money you're gonna waste your time and effort on it and ultimately your projects whatever you worked on is gonna get shut down i'm not defending activision here but how many times this gotta happen for fans and people to wake up and understand they don't care about us right they never cared about us so this isn't even a shocker to me. I'm not sure why the homie, especially the homie blame truth, right? Like, I don't get it, bro. Like, you you know they struck it down last year. So you think that they wouldn't have struck it down this year? Like, damn, bro. Like, anyone that buys Black Ops 6 and expects things to be good, you deserve all of the garbage you're going to get this next year. And, and any other year you purchase this game and support these criminals, these literal crooks. Look at this, okay? H2M, shut down. Why? Oh, man. W why? I don't know. They got cease and desisted, and I have no idea why. People were saying when SM2 got- And they had to do it on my birthday, man. Like, damn, homie. Like, I'm high on sugar right now, bro. You feel what I'm saying? I'm high on sugar right now, bro. Like, damn, they had to do it today. That's crazy, man. Like, y'all suckers, these suckers, mamas gotta whoop their asses, bro. Activision employees, mamas gotta whoop their asses, bro. At the boot, it was because they got off an old client and were suggesting people pirate the game. I, I don't know. 
Anyway, okay. <laughs> Modern Warfare Remastered went on sale. It went on sale. Activision waits until one day before the release of H2M and then rugs us after we have already bought the game. We have the homie Nero Shenwa. Activision just played us all. They let people think that the march was going to go live while having Modern Warfare Remastered. <laughs> Yo, these suckers crazy, man. I'm talking about Activision. When I said these suckers, I mean Activision. Nah, these suckers really crazy? Okay, I did not have that context, though. That's wild. They cash in on an eight-year-old game, then pull the rug out from under the players. Damn. Damn, man. Damn. After they put it on sale, you need Modern Warfare Remastered, an official copy, and they, the, the dev said this, to play the mod. There is absolutely no profit being made. If, if Activision are afraid of some modders re-releasing a game they did not want to re-release in Modern Warfare 2, then why in the hell yeah. are they not just, I don't know, hiring these modders and officially releasing the game to make money? Is it because they can't pump the old game full of microtransactions without us getting angry? Is it because maybe people want to play a good call of duty again and or i'm thinking maybe like they they couldn't make the valley <laughs> maybe 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 th uh, these modders were not about making the friendly uav online bundle so this is why they're not gonna hire them maybe that's the reason of course like <laughs> of course i'm joking around but now nah, honestly like especially in this day and age when you have microsoft activision firing their devs on because of ai and stuff like that yeah they're not gonna hire people they're firing devs instead bro and not have to worry about their information getting stolen their ip address leaked what have you you can't go back and play the old mw2 it's a security risk like i, I don't know what to say I, I don't get it. Maybe it's because, oh, I, I know what it is. They can't manipulate the matchmaking. It's on a server browser. We, we gotta tailor the experience to Timmy No Thumbs. See, the data, oh, we covered the data last video. Oh, the data, oh, the data shows that Timmy No Thumbs loves skill-based matchmaking. He's gonna buy a skin that makes him look like a virgin if we protect him with our casino-based matchmaking. Thank you and good night. There's none of that in, in H2M. It's just a server browser. You just, you just boot up and play. Okay, on that one, it's uh, it's facts that uh, it, it Call of Duty got that UMM and all that, right? SBMM, UMM and all that. You play five games and these suckers know how many kids you're gonna have, if your girl is preggo or not. Yeah, like, so they're gonna find out before you find out. Absolute ludicrous. Yes, okay? But like, tranquilo, puppy. Tranquilo. I don't know. I, I don't know. Someone explain it to me, please. The only thing I can think of is they are legitimately worried that this mod on PC is going to take players or sales away from Black Ops 6 coming out. It, yeah. It, I, I don't understand. This billion dollar I, I I think Blame Truth really have dementia. So, like, he has dementia. Bro, like, listen, I'm with you on it, right? But the way you're saying it, bro, it, feel, it, it makes me feel like that. You didn't know. You never knew that Activision could ever do such a thing. Of course, bro, like a year and a half ago, somebody made a map uh, mod for them. They struck it down. So why do you think they're not going to do the same thing? They're doing the same thing. Yeah, it's shitty. I get that. Uh, yeah, absolutely. They shouldn't have done it. But like, damn, they did it before. They're, they're going to do it again. So like company are afraid of a group of guys in their basement just using some scripting for, for like an old game released in 2016. Is that what it's come to? Imagine if Bethesda did that with Skyrim. Skyrim, the most modded, like, game ever, you know? <laughs> like, imagine if they did that for every single mod that came out that just made the game more fun. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. How about you just make a good game, and you don't have to worry about this. Make a good game that people will stick with. No, they're, they're doing the same thing again they've done uh, countless times before. They are fooling this moronic community. I'm sorry, the Call of Duty community are the dumbest motherfuckers I have ever seen. If I were in war with you guys... Yo, tranquilo, papi. Tranquilo, man. Tranquilo. Man, we need some. Guys, take your right hand, take your left hand. Send a prayer out this man's way, man. Brother hurt right now. Brother hurt, though. No, I, I get it. Like, I'm a. Uh, yeah, like, I, I get it. Like, they shouldn't have struck that uh, mod down, but damn, like, brother hurt right now. Poppy hurt right now. Poppy hurt. I would pull a Leroy Jenkins. I have a better chance of survival than depending on you to watch my back is all I'm gonna say Absolute morons just today just today and I've covered this just recently I've covered this just recently, but just today a million dollar tournament got ruined because the Call of Duty servers are horrific And if this is going to happen during a million dollar million with an M 
dollar tournament. What makes you think that zombies is gonna run good being online only on these horrible servers? Mm -hmm. Go watch a video from my buddy Nero. Look at every single time he posts Modern Warfare 3 and look at the packet burst symbol that pops up in the upper left hand corner. Yeah, it's all right. Like, what in the hell are we doing? Yeah. Am I insane? I, I, what you're saying is facts. But tranquilo, papi, tranquilo. I don't want you having a heart attack, brother. Like, damn, man. Like, don't do it, bro. We need you. I need you. We need you. You are over a therapy session, man. Every time I hear you, I'm having free therapy, and I love it. I love it. I respect it. You know what I'm saying? Like, papi, tranquilo. But papi, tranquilo. That's what I'm saying. Take it easy, brother. Take it easy. It ain't that deep. It is deep, but it ain't that deep, you know? It is deep, but it ain't that deep. Why do you guys continue Bruh. to let this company ream you in the ass? <laughs> I'm serious. Why? What's wrong with you? My man, you also buy the game. You're the first one in line buying the game, so you cannot tell like other people to not buy the game. You you gotta li listen. Like you you gotta stop buying the game, and then you can tell other people, hey, stop buying the game. You you feel what I'm saying? Like, at this point, what is wrong with you? Are you so casual? You just want to come home, suck your fucking vape pen until you get lung cancer, and then uh, play Call of Duty in, in a protected bracket against the world's worst players so you can go, like, 11 and 10 and then post the score on Instagram with the Clarendon filter? Is that your entire existence? Play something better! Play something where the devs and the studio... Uh, like, X Defiant? Play something better like X Defined? Is that what you're trying to say? <laughs> Guys, we gotta have an emergency meeting immediately, okay? Why in the comments, if you think X Defined is the best game in the world? Two in the comments, if it's not. Three, if you're like, you know, sometime it bustin', sometime it ain't bustin'. Uh, it's mid, it's I, it's I. I wanna know where you at. I wanna know where you at. So yeah, give us games, man. Like, yeah, X Defined, that's what you want us to play? and maybe even the publisher somewhat care like I, I don't understand it i don't get it my dog's in here because he thinks i'm dying right now by the way hey buddy uh, but no like seriously <laughs> he's literally comforting yo his dog be like this right now his dog be like this hey, man. <laughs> hey blame to it like why you why you like i'm the dog bro like why you barking man let me bark let me bark you know what i'm saying why you barking yo like listen to your dog brother listen to your dog man. <laughs> right now got guys this is no laughing matter though there, there is nothing, there is nothing. I mean, they, the devs did it right. The devs for H2M did it right. They did nothing wrong. They're not trying to profit. They're not promoting anything yeah. illegal. They're not like yeah, stealing yeah, yeah. assets. This was all scripting. Like, it just makes no sense, dude. It makes no sense. I the biggest agree. mystery I to agree. me though, seriously, the biggest mystery to me is this player base. Not just the player base, not just Call of Duty. This is not exclusive to Call of Duty, but the FPS player base in general. Guys, I've been playing X Defiant, just as an example. I've been playing X Defiant since it came out on May 21st. I've gotten pretty damn good. I've got a lot of FPS experience, and yeah. i played... Oh, Call hey, here we go again. Here we go again. He's now gonna glaze X Defiant. X Defiant is an alright game. It's not the worst game. It's not the best game uh, ever, but alright. Here we go again. Of Duty games in the past and other FPS games in the past where the more time you put in, the better you got, the better your performance is going to be. Even in this game, and you're gonna see it at the end here. Just look at the in-game scoreboard or whatever. It is rare. It is actually rare. I get people on my team when I'm playing solo that are any good ever. Mm. Straight up. You, you know what? I, I, I gotta say this, man. Brother is loving X Defiant, and that is so good, guys. That is so amazing. I like that. I like that. I like that. I like that. I'm I'm glad that finally Blame Truth has found Blame Truth has found something that he enjoys. Yeah, I'm not gonna be anyone to like dump take a dump on his parade. Nah, bro. I don't want to ruin that. Like. He loves the uh, he loves extra fine that's amazing man because this is my first time finding out that he loves that game so it's good that he likes the game finally and the homie eight thoughts right he likes call of duty right now so that's good i'm happy for both of these fellas like both of these fellas are always uh up to each other neck and always trying to like you know uh poke each other ball sack and whatnot right Bruh. or maybe not i, I gotta I, I gotta i gotta tranquilo as well okay i gotta tra i gotta be tranquilo right now too but but now nah, it really feels like that both of them are trying to like fuck 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 like that like to each other it's like damn man like you like call of duty he loves x to find hey man that's that's amazing you know what i'm saying like that's that's amazing man like bro brother brother's gotta chill man brother's gotta chill but all right let's get back to the content now boo boo and I'm not talking like good as in, oh, this guy's a beast. This guy is scump. I'm talking just someone that wants to win the match. Someone that could hop on a point. 
I might get one teammate out of like five matches that will actually try to play domination like it's domination and hop on a point. It's like every FPS player in the past five years has severe brain rot. What has <laughs> happened? Is this the result of skill-based matchmaking? Uh, 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 yeah, it probably is, but also hey, 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 it is also because of this uh, helmet that you were promoting as well, man. Damn, man, you really did that to your fan base, man. You really made them buy this uh, and get brain damage. I, I, I'm assuming like half of the brain damage that that you're talking about was given because of the helmet, man. Allegedly, allegedly, of course, allegedly. EOMM, whatever you want to call it in Call of Duty and, and other games, just ru ah! ruining people. Do people not want to try for fear of just getting punished for it with harder competition or cheaper competition or being thrust into a lobby with cheaters or what have you? I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. People still say that like X Defiant has a lot of sweaters on it, has a lot of sweaty players on it. I, it's not my experience, but it kind of makes sense because J God made a video recently talking about how players on Call of Duty just want easy lobbies. They just want yeah. easy lobbies. I don't want easy lobbies. I want to improve to the point where nearly every lobby is easy for me. That's what I want. Nobody else wants that. Nobody cares about improving. They just want to deteriorate and decline and get protected and get their hand held. What weak, pissy individuals. It's the entire FPS community, I I'm convinced. Now, uh, maybe I'm just taking it too seriously. Maybe I'm just a try-hard sweat and I'm just, I, I don't know, an asshole. But like, look at my team here. I had one uh, guy- You probably are. You probably are. Guy that wasn't that good, 10 and 15, but he played the objective. The rest of the team, I, I mean, they were there, you know? Like, th that's what I don't understand. Yeah, 40 kills, nine, that's I, oh my God, this guy's a try-hard, he's a try <laughs> <laughs> He, uh, he is. I mean, he said that he's a try-hard, he is. Look at that. No, oh my god, nobody nobody could break past 20. Okay, no, the enemy team 23 kills, but let's just say nobody broke past 25 kills and my guy blamed out there like 40 kills. That's crazy, man. That's crazy, bro. I'm out of time, guys. Rate, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, I want to listen to the whole V8 uh, thoughts for a second. Okay, over to Modern Warfare 2. Multiplayer remastered, oh my god, I've been shot down, fuck you Activision, I hate you guys, there has been a cease and desist order on behalf of Activision Publishing guys, holy shit man, we are complying with this order and shutting down all operations permanently, oh my god, I can't believe they did this guy, <laughs> <laughs> what a group of giants, now no, no, this one okay, it talks he's like com completely on the other extreme, blame truth is completely on the other other extreme uh, point i'm in the middle with this one yeah what activision has done is pathetic shouldn't have done it but like damn bro like damn blame truth being this mad it's like bro like you got dementia or something because they did i mean after you are the one you also said the same thing they took down the mod like a year and a half ago i'm not defending activision here but like we saw that happen right yeah like what do you think they're gonna do you, you, you thought that they're gonna give them a cookie you thought that they were gonna give him a cookie? Bruh. Is that what you thought? Like, come on, man. Like, they're gonna strike it down. Beta male, simp ass, moron, idiots. Seriously. What in the actual fuck are you morons upset about? What are you actually surprised about? I told you all. I told you all. To did he? Did he? Did he tell us? Did he tell us? I don't know. I I, I didn't hear you tell us anything. Though. Like I'm just saying. Like I didn't hear anything. Bruh. But maybe maybe you maybe you thought you told people. Maybe inside maybe in your mind you said it. Or maybe I missed the video. I, I'm joking around, man. I love you, homie. I love you. Let me show you kisses right now, Baba. Two days ago that this was going to happen. There is no way it, Activision is going to allow someone to make a game better than their own developers. Yeah. You can love it or hate it, but these are the facts. Activision mm, is mm, a company mm, that mm. doesn't give a fine fuck about mm, any mm, of you. Mm, mm, mm. And the fact that any of you were dumb enough to think that they would allow this mod, considering that Sim 2, Modern Warfare 2 sort of remastered game, got a cease and desist order as well, like three months ago, and also like these people are so brain dead. How many videos you guys see? Black Ops 6 is canceled. Black Ops 6 is in big trouble, guys. Yeah! Hey, whoa, 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 hey, tranquilo, 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 Black Ops 6 Zombies gameplay is a disaster, dude, there are quotes, I was watching the homie, okay, let me actually do this here, uh, where is that, I was watching the homie blame truth in that, I was watching the homie. He was mad about the gameplay. I think the gameplay looks good. I think the gameplay looks good. 
I was watching and uh, discussing about his video, brother. Like, I ain't mad about Black Ops 6 Zombies. Black Ops 6 Zombies is looking kind of good right now, so. Ooh, my over to rematch is gonna be so amazing! Ah. Like, you guys are gonna be the dumbest group of people I've ever seen in my life. And seriously, seriously, am I like the only adult and the only person in this whole damn community that has an IQ above 50? Like, you are all morons. Like, absolute morons. Everything's so upset, so sad. Like, listen, listen, listen. All right. Activision can pound sand. They're a piece yeah, of shit yeah, company. Yeah, yeah. They're, yeah, but yeah. here's the thing. Your emotions have nothing to do with reality, all right? You can facts. all be emotional as you want. As Ben Shapiro said, facts don't care about your feelings. And any of you surprised by this, and even upset by this, you're outing yourself as being simp, morons, beta male type behavior. E okay, yeah, no, absolutely. It's like, you cannot defend Activision, but... It's something that we all kind of saw this coming, man. You know what I'm saying? It'd be what it'd be. But guys, check out this video on the screen. This is what happened with Dr. Disrespect. Some new information came out, and it is wilder than Johnny Sin's movies, bro. Check it out, and I'll see you right there. If you already seen it, then check out the video on the left.